ladies tonight? Good. Doing really well, yeah. So what's the most exciting thing about Giveology joining with M Night for you? I think like three things. The first one is that we get to expand our partnerships network because we get to partner with more grassroots causes. The second one is like the awareness that we could bring together by bringing, pulling our networks of supporters. And third, it's to be able to like bounce creative ideas off each other to see if we can do more campaigns like this and work together. So this is a very exciting union. What inspired you to make this union with Giveology? You know, like when I spoke about it, they very they, they were inspiring to me as human beings, but they also had a fantastic idea that I thought they could execute. So I just wanted to be a part of it very selfishly. I don't think you're selfish, but I think it's great, you know, your ideas about, you know, bringing education not only around the world, but in the U.S., which I think is important. Yeah, definitely. I mean, education is, for me, domestically, it's the last civil rights movement, in my opinion. So it's the thing we need to focus on because one generation, we can fix it. And then it's an even playing field. Yeah, it's great. I mean, children are all alike around the world. They all smile alike and laugh alike, and they all you know, want the same thing, to be loved and to be educated and to just be cared for, and I think that's great. Yeah, their resilience is incredible. and We're, we're the ones that break that down over their, their, their life, and if we can ignite it rather than break it down, that would be the hope. That's wonderful. What's the most exciting thing about this for you? Well, you know, to be around like-minded people that take don't take no for an answer and uh, believe that they have the power themselves, I love it. That's great. Thank you so much. This is a wonderful thing. How about you, Gina? Yeah, no, I agree. I think it's expanding our network, growing to a new level. I mean, this is like the biggest event that we've thrown since we've started. So just really taking everything to a new level and like a new caliber of like raising money for the kids because it's really all about the kids. Here's the partnership. <laughs> this or mentor in your life and how has that educated you uh, through your life? In some ways my dad, you know he's no longer here but he always said to us if I leave you guys with anything it'll be an education and he truly believed in the power of education um, and even as a youngster you know wasn't in our culture for girls to be educated you know it was more about malleability, getting married, and stuff like that, even in my day. And I had to fight for an education. Um, and I, my dad was the one that was kind of really behind it. You know, the power of thought, the power of choice, the power of, everything comes with education. Really, if you want true freedom, and you want true choice, and you want to make the most of yourself, you need education, you need to know. And I love learning, so if I love it so much, I want everyone to be able to have that. So that's, you know, that's been my guide. One of the things about poverty is that it takes away all your options. You know, people think, oh, they can fight their ways out of it. Have you been there? No, you can't. Sometimes you really can't. Maybe the odd person can, and by whatever, you know, uh, amazing circumstances they get out of it. Most people, you can't, it's difficult. And they don't have a choice. They don't have the opportunity. They don't have hope anymore. And that is that is unacceptable, you know, to me that we, that people live that way. You know, we take away all of what it means to be human, the human spirit, when you take away choice. And the only way to that is education. What's the best advice you can give? Well, you know, when you get to express yourself to another human being, your love, your kindness, it makes you actually feel fulfilled. You know, it's, when we feel alone is when we, we really feel depressed. When we connect with other people is when we feel alive. That's great. Great advice. Finding all that, that you are is all that you can, you know, is everything that you can do. Everything that you are is what they need. Yes. You know, is what the world needs. So just give what you are. Forget about the mistakes. You know, don't worry about it. And we all make mistakes, we're all imperfect. Just be willing, just have the heart to do it and just take that first step. It doesn't matter if it's wrong or right, you're going down that path, it's part of the path.